Hi, I'm Carl Azus, and we have a more sensitive subject than usual this week. Around the world, there are scores of people who can only celebrate their birthdays on their birth dates once every four years. And unfortunately for these poor people, this ain't one of them. Yes, it's a fun joke for those of us who weren't born on February 29th. You can't have your birthday. <laughs> Their consolation dates are February 28th or March 1st, but only in leap years do we have 29 days in February, and the next one of those is in 2024. Rossini was born on February 29th, he was an Italian composer, and even my ancestry and a semester of Italian couldn't help me with his first name. Shortstop Dickie Pierce, dancer Eva Marie Feigl, band leader Jimmy Dorsey, and Pope Paul III, all of them unable to celebrate on their birth date but once every four years. Why is this? Well, a year isn't exactly 365 days. What? No, it's about 365 and a quarter days. So to account for that one-fourth of an extra day, we just add one every four years. According to Encyclopedia Britannica, this practice dates back to the year 46 BC. Romans, who did quite a bit of roaming around, wanted the calendar aligned with the seasons. And as different Roman rulers tinkered with the math, changing the numbers of months and numbers of days in them, what they eventually settled on, what's known as the Gregorian calendar, left February with a shorter than average 28 days and left the year with an extra quarter day to make up with leap years and a 29th day in February. Now that I have calendared to explore that, I'm going to turn the page, save the date, count the hours, pass the time, and get more seasoned reports on the calendar so I can see y'all another day. I'm Carl Azus, reporting for Sunlight.